Well, hello. Bon appetit. I thought it would be kind of fun, since I'm doing some remodeling and my house is crazy, just to, to um, do it right here in my living room, because why not? I am going to do another treats, 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 treats. So today is fall, and so I thought I get my comfy sweater, my comfy velvet sweats, and show you how I relax and think about traveling somewhere on this fall day. Um, the great thing about these are you can just order them and travel to different places in the comfort of your own home. I love that. So today, we are traveling to Coco Cabana, Brazil. And is that not the most beautiful place? I would love to go to Brazil. So this month's treats come from Brazil, the fifth largest country in the world, both by land area and popular population. Brazil is the only country in South America that does not speak Spanish. Isn't that cool? Don't you like to learn? I do. Okay, so they do not speak Spanish and it is also the country with the largest Roman Catholic population in the world as well as the largest exporter of coffee for more than 150 years. Brazilians are soccer crazy and their country has produced one of the world's greatest football players named Edson Arantes do Nasci Camido, better known as Peely. There goes my earring, the back of my earring. Okay, stay earring for this. You know when you get cute earrings on and then one just wants to go before you're even done. Oh my gosh. So Peely, furthermore, millions of tourists visit Rio de Janeiro each year to see the famous Christ the Redeemer statue. Google it if you're interested. Rio de Janeiro is also home of so home to two of the famous beaches in the world, Ipanema and Capucabana. And when it comes to food, Brazil is known for tasty dishes like fijada, and bridaderos and coxenhas. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm ruining these names for you, which is on the back of your fun facts card and which you can see for yourself, which you can make for yourself. So isn't that beautiful? So, so have fun today. Let's travel to Brazil and try the treats. Now, um, Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You never know whether you're going to like the box or not. I never know, but I'm like, you know what? They're sending them to me. This is great. I'm game to try them. Are you game to watch me try them? And then if you're interested, of course, treats.com and use code Ursula and you'll be able to get your treats sent to you. So where should I put it? Oh my gosh. So let's start with Torcida. It says it's bacon, bacon flavored. These look like, there goes my earring. And my, so I'm gonna do this, don't mind the if I do this with just one earring. I'll go like this. So, hmm. These are not good. I don't know how to, they're little balls. They're just like little balls. And it's supposed to taste like bacon. They just don't have, they're like kind of flavorless. They're just kind of like, ew. I don't, I don't like them. Maybe my dogs will. Maybe they'll take maybe these will be their new treats. 
my dog doesn't even like them. So anyway, this is a no. I don't like these. Yuck. I don't like those. So it's not starting too good, is it? Okay, let's try these. So apparently they like their chips. These are Kanchinha Sebra Presunto Yoka Toes. I'm going to try these. Okay. What are these? These, rem these remind me of like um, like these puffed puffed chips that we have here, like air pop puffed chips, like air puffs. They're okay. They're kind of they don't have a lot of flavor. They're just kind of like. How would I describe them? Um, Funyuns, but without the Funyuns, but without the onion flavor, consistency. So there's that. So not so good so far. And then these, these are looking kind of plain as well. These almost look like white pretzels or croutons. I don't know. Brazil. Not liking Brazil food snacks. Okay, they look like this. Kind of flavorless, you know? Yeah, I don't think I'd waste my calories on this. Not good. They seem just flavorless to me. Like, plain. Maybe that's the word. Like, you know, here we have barbecue, sour cream, cheddar. These are just like, they say they're barbecue flavored, but they're, the barbecue is so little I mean not much so you can't even taste the barbecue so it's almost like eating I want to say these are like you know those hard breadsticks that sometimes you get like in they come in a container here and they're hard and they're crunchy but they don't have any flavor that's what I would say it would taste like I don't even taste the barbecue so I don't even know what they're talking about with the barbecue. All right, so then, I'm using my scissors. People were concerned last time that I wasn't using my scissors. This looks like it might be really good. If you know how to pronounce this, then let me know. This looks good. So I got my scissors. I'm prepared this time. Ooh, this looks good. This is, oh, it looks like um, one of those bars that, oh yeah, look at this. Look at that. So it's like, like a white chocolate or something and nuts inside. Mmm, that's good. Finally, Brazil! Finally! Oh my gosh! That's really good. Mmm. Caramel. Mmm. So yes, finally, something is good. That's delicious. What else? Um, let me tell you what that was. Okay, the bar I just tasted that I liked. White chocolate bar that melts in your mouth combined with a crunchy dolce de leche texture 
the combination of soft white chocolate and Dolce de Leche is one of our one out of the ordinary and guaranteed um, you'll find yourself craving more. And that is a yes and amen because that was delicious. Now this that I'm about to try right here, I have no idea. It is one of Brazil's best-selling bomb bombs because of the exciting taste. The candy consists of a thin wafer with two layers of delicious chocolate flavored coating filled with irresistible cashew cream. And if you know me, cashews are my favorite. Oh girl, oh boy. Let's get into this. Oh my gosh, it's big. Let's open it up. Look at how huge that is. Woo wee, that's my kind of candy. Mmm. It's got like a wafer in there like Twix does. So it's chocolate and then it's got a wafer. Mmm. Kind of thin wafer, two layers of delicious chocolate flavoring, coated, filled with irresistible cashew cream. Yes, that's really good. Mm. Delicious. So that I like those. It came with two. So so far it's the desserts. I'm all about the desserts. This. Pasta Tempapo or whatever. This is extremely popular cookie. Shh, go outside. Shh, sorry, my dogs. Popular cookie stuffed with milk chocolate filled with exceptionally designed to provide a nutrition filled and fun snack time made with Oat cereal, whole milk, and chocolate favored drops. Ooh. So let's try it out. Again, man, they package stuff good. So I got my scissors. Proud of me, I got my scissors. I heard your comment. Oh, it's like little cookie. So it's got, oh, I smashed that side. It's got a little character on that side and a character on that side. Mmm. Soft wafer cookie with chocolate in the inside. Good. Delicious. Mm hmm. Oh, this looks like it's banana. Banana cream soda. So this one is. Oh, there we go. Naturally light. Says naturally light, healthy, trust, tasty snack made from overripe bananas. These overripe bananas are mixed with sugar to create highly nutritional snack made especially for those who like to have healthy food at any time of the day. Oh, so they said something healthy. Ooh, overripe bananas, a healthy snack. It, it doesn't look that great. But it's good. It tastes like bananas. It's got a, um, mmm. Delicious. Chewy consistency that melts in your mouth. Tastes like bananas. So I like that. I'll save that. What else do we got? I got, where is it? Okay, so Chicodio, this thing. Um, a chocolate bar with chewy fudge center with crunchy rice crisp covered with real milk chocolate how can you say no, say yes to the good stuff? Okay, so this is to the good stuff. Let's try it. Ooh. 
So this reminds me of like the Nestle bars that we have here with the little puffs in them. Mmm, it's delicious. So they know what they're doing with their sweet department. They just don't know the snack part. You want one, Donna? She doesn't even like those. Okay, so this one is, um, what is it? Carab Carabib or something. Here's this. Oh, the Caribbean is a successful blend of tropical flavors with amazing combination of milk chocolate and banana filling flavor. It is a wonder that Caribbean is one of the most treasured bourbons in Brazil. Ooh, I gotta try that sometime. So this is what it looks like. I would say it tastes like chocolate banana bread. I would say if you put chocolate on the outside of banana bread, that's exactly what this tastes like. Very good. Who would have thought? Chocolate on banana bread? That's a winner. Batten. And then last but not least, we got batten. And this is the white chocolate bourbon is complete Brazilian treat the combination of cashew nuts and white chocolate is one of oh, let's see what let's see where is it i lost it okay white chocolate is as good as it gets if you're planning to visit brazil a taste of these delicious bourbons will get you in the mood okay um Break it open with my teeth. Oh. So I was <laughs> I was expecting it to be like um, individual. But no, you you it's all one solid. So I bit into it thinking, okay, I'll just get like, you know what I'm talking about, like tic tacs or individual. But it's not. It's one solid thing. It's good, but look at that. So it's in one tube and it's just solid. It's not individuals. I'm crazy, right? But it's good. So thank you for watching my Treats from Brazil review. Um, I love doing these because like I said, it's just so fun. Like. When you're when you don't get an opportunity to travel all the time, or if you're just hanging out at home, you just go, hmm, I wonder what the treats would taste like here, or I wonder what the treats would taste like there. Um, it just kind of has a way of taking you there to this magical place. And so I hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching. And as always, if you want to push the link, the code down there and put or do treats.com and do code Ursula, you can get yourself uh, so a discount to get these. And so I'm gonna leave with popping in this deliciousness. Mm, mm, mm. It's a beautiful day to travel at home. Thanks for watching. The dogs don't even wanna eat the bacon. And they say bacon and the dogs don't even like them.